As we get ready to take in the great American eclipse on Monday, have your glasses ready to see the solar show. So what happens if you take a peek with your naked eye? First of all, don't do it. 13 on your side health reporter Elena Holland spoke to an eye doctor to find out why. It's a sight you don't see very often, but a sight you don't want to see without the help of special eclipse glasses. There is no safe time at which to look at it here. Dr. Matthew Bohr is an ophthalmologist with the University of Michigan Health West. He says staring directly at the eclipse without eye protection will damage your eyes. It really can be just kind of an instant. It can be more tempting to look at the sun during an eclipse, but it is one of the worst times to do the damaging peak. Dr. Bohr says that's because the moon is blocking some of the brightness of the sun, tricking your reflexes to not look away. But the same amount of power is coming through. Our eye kind of works like a magnifying glass onto the film of the camera on the back of the eye, and that can actually burn the retina that intakes that light. So what happens to make it so damaging to look at the solar phenomenon? It's essentially a burn on that retina, a burn spot, sometimes even in basically in the shape of the eclipse. Causing permanent blind spots in your vision, if not total vision loss. We cannot fix that. It's brain tissue, it's extension of the brain as the retina, uh, and that is not repairable. There is, however, a very short window you can look at the sun during the eclipse but you cannot do that here in West Michigan. So if you're traveling down to Ohio or the path of totality, when that sun is completely gone, then it would be safe to take off the glasses, but it, they need to go right back on once the sun starts to reappear. To avoid that permanent eye damage, make sure to wear eclipse glasses during the event Monday. It's important to enjoy the experience, but also enjoy it safely. Elena, what kind of glasses do you need? Well, you'll need to get special solar eclipse glasses, you know, something like this. And they are vetted by the American Astronomical Society, the retailers that sell them. But the good news is you can get them at most places and they can be as cheap as, you know, like two bucks. You could also make a pinhole projector out of items in your house if you want to look at the eclipse indirectly and you might not have glasses. We have instructions to do that and a list of retailers for glasses on 13yourside.com. Well, I can't see you at all with these. Oh, I know. <laughs> you can't see anything but the sun when you have these on. So. That's a good thing. Thank you, Elena, for that information.